Welcome to the Thargoid Report. I'm Commander Burr. This is a weekly breakdown of the ongoing conflict with the Thargoids and a guide to how you can easily get involved and make a difference. If you find this information useful and enjoy our content then do give the video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to make sure you see all our future videos. The Thargoids weekly station attacks still remain offline and all is quiet in both the bubble and the newly established enclave in the Witch Head Nebula. If you want to help with the recovery efforts from previous attacks then there's now two avenues for you to explore. The guys from Operation Ida are actively engaged with a serious quantity of damaged stations inside the bubble ...their discord is linked below and with the lack of stations currently in need of evacuation the post disaster evacuation service has turned its resources towards the Witch Head Nebula with great effect. One station is already back online and another is well on the way. Once again their discord is linked below. In both cases in order to contribute you just need a cargo hauling capable vessel and a galactic map. Both communities will be able to guide you on what to bring and where to take it. The Eagle Eye sensor network is currently reporting that the following systems are infested with Thargoid scouts. Sterope 2 HIP 18502 Pleiades Sector MIS B41 HIP 17481 Witch Head Sector IRW C19 and Witch Head Sector IRW C18. As at the time of recording there are no systems showing as in incursion but the larger Thargoid vessels are available in the usual fixed instances. It's always wise to tackle the Thargoids with some support and you'll find links below to discord servers for the AXI, the Hive and the Hand. Those guys will be able to lead you to some of the permagoid sites if you don't know where they already are. Between them these groups have all platforms covered, they're a really friendly bunch and whatever your level of competence they'll help you find bugs to suit your needs. Wherever you go commanders remember pick your fights with care. With the conclusion of the Enclave Interstellar initiative a new engineer has been installed in the Witch Head sector and 6 new planetary bases have come online to support the new stations that came online and were then attacked a couple of weeks ago. With a new colonia now filling that area so rapidly it's clearly apparent that that nebula has significance for Frontier and for the game going forward. What that significance is we don't yet know but it seems to me at least that this new area should be in pretty good shape by the end of the year when fleet carriers arrive. Is it just a distraction to keep the bugs out of the bubble or perhaps a staging area or forward operating base for a push into Barnard's Loop and the Coal Sector. That's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. You can also find us on Twitter, Patreon, Discord and Instagram. Links to all those are in the description below and we'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then O7 CMDRs may all your high predictions be brief and don't let the murder flowers give you nightmares. I very much look forward to seeing you next time. <laughs>